And also in Venezuela, we continue with our coverage of the world's first social pre-cop. 20 representatives from over 80 so global social movements will present a document to UN representatives this week outlining urgent demands for tackling climate change. Here's our correspondent Rachel Boothroyd with more. Creating small-scale and family-run farming projects is one of the suggestions that environmental social movements gathered here at the world's first social pre-cop are putting forward for tackling climate change. It's an urgent proposal which they have been discussing over the past two days and which they plan to put to 47 representatives of the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change when they meet with them on the Venezuelan island of Margarita this week. The transnationals use a whole package of chemicals and toxins during the planting and harvesting processes. And what this does is damage the earth, subterranean water supplies, the rivers and pollute nearby communities, giving them a whole host of different illnesses. The movements say that it doesn't have to be this way. A possible solution lies just a few kilometers away from the conference in the island's mountaintops. We headed